Um, to donate to us, you can email us at themullings at gmail.com. To join our online school tutor class, you can email us now at themullings at gmail.com. For a private consultation for writs, affidavits, stopples, the new nationality documents, our books, etc., you can email us at themullings at gmail.com. All right, now someone did share this with me on Instagram, um, the science to exterminate blacks. And it's a scientist who um, apparently if they need um, for any kind of court attendancies um, to verify or to have a witness, they use this particular guy. You guys are going to go and research what he's saying. Don't take my word for it. Don't take his word for it. See if it's true. Attention all international authorities, I require you to investigate this matter regarding the RNA fragments using bioweapons to target a specific group of people such as blacks. As such, I require you to shut down and charge all the agents involved for treason, genocide, racketeering, identity theft, peonage, estate theft, um, using this RNA technology and remove it from the market this instant and stop the targeting of any such race. Thank you. By Noble Honorable Angelina D. Alfred, L. Alt, right, all rights reserved. Now, apparently, what he's explaining is the RNA fragments that can kill the bugs feeding on the foods. This technology can also be fine-tuned to target a specific race who eat that food. They can also cause infertility in black people in, um, alone, like they can target supposedly now, we know through the Tuskegee experiments and um, the Niagara Falls, um, the NAACP, and all those things that they had set up for us um, prior, basically, with all their extermination, genocidal um, things that had been implemented. Just check and see if this is on, um, if this is on the table. They can also target... Um, physiological processes in insects. So by the insect feeding on that particular food, once the food has been injected or has this RNA factor in it, the insects will then um, can die instantly from feeding on that food. They can also interfere with the mobility in animals, um, which exists as well for the people, right? So those of us who have been subjected to tar different types of targeting know this um, through other tar forms of technologies that they're using, whether it's internet or whether it's other technologies or it's the other videos that I created earlier with the doctor complaining about all the other um, biological chemical warfares that are in play. Go and shut them down. Now, are they using that technology today? is the question, right? You guys are going to go, to doing the, go and do the research on that. Um, there, he's saying to look at the plummeting sperm count in black men. Now, um, you guys know a lot of people come to us here for a lot of different um, situations. And um, you guys know from our previous videos that there's a lot of remedies that um, we who have been studying for many moons discovered um, whether you go on YouTube and you can research those for yourself, you know, the usual gin, Glenfiddich whiskey, 32% um, food grade hydrogen peroxide distilled water, those different things that you can research, right? Also the stones that you can put around your house to get rid of some of those energies, right? But more importantly, you guys need to be conscious of what's going on. The difficulty is that those of us who eat primarily fruits and vegetables, um, who try to grow our own stuff, who try to stay away from all the crap and all the garbage that is being put out there in this universe. Um, it's just challenging in order to um, remain completely, you know, oblivious to all the stuff that's going on. And though we can also shed a blind eye to this, the fact of the matter is it does affect our own people, right? Even some of those wicked ones, those dirty ones that um, you guys can think about the same as I can think about, it affects them too, right? Known as biological warfare. 
do they deserve to be taken on like that? I don't know. That's up to the universe to, to make that decision. But I don't want to know that's really um, out there in that way, right? Anyway, apparently what he's explaining is that same energies, the same entities that control the waterways, um, the waters are being affected by the for those Native Americans. And I was researching that. I talked about that in an earlier video. A lot of these places in Canaanite land, Canada, Ontario, they're doing genocide on the fake um, $5 Indians, right? Which, man, and also the water in like places like Ohio and different places that the water is being affected, same group. So those of you conscious mores, go and do what you need to do. If you're in those areas or you're familiar with what, what's going on, you have to lean up those entities so they can stop. Let Mother Nature take its course as much as possible, right? And because um, the universe, it's universal laws. And what happens is um, we who are divinely connected know it's a divine and national movement, right? So that simply means nature's law kicks in automatically. Um, the same government runs the FBI. The same, I don't know if they're government's de facto agents doing business as government as per the Clarefield Doctrine. Now, you guys can use the Clarefield Doctrine, which is the 1942 Supreme Court case between the Clarefield Trust Company and the United States Corporation, which was a case that exposed the 1861 coup d'etat, which that meant Congress had yet to return, left office had yet, and has yet to return to office. Hence, when these agents are reduced to using Federal Reserve notes, they can be sued in their private capacity. Okay? So anyways, he goes on to explain all the different covert technologies that have caused all these spontaneous... They're doing all these covert um, technologies that are causing spontaneous abortions. So just be conscious of that. You guys be aware of that. Claim your nationality. Correct your status. If you're more, you're Moorish American Indian. You're American Indians, Moorish American nationals. Okay, go and um, correct your status today and see if you can get away from a lot of this corruption that's going on globally. Eh? All right, you guys, like, share, subscribe. Thank you to Copper Aborigines. I'll see if I can read some more of this stuff. What she's saying, what, the, what he's saying, I keep saying she, he's saying is the affidavit that I just read in lieu of the um, removing one from the driver's license, the new um, right to travel documents via um, us American Indians, Moorish American nationals. Again, you can use the RV Bay publications, travel documents. You can use the Moorish American consulate travel documents, or you could just use the Moorish, the RV Bay publications, travel documents. Or in our case, I don't use any <coughs> of the drive, the traveling ones per se. Well, I use the, the Moorish American national document, but um, yeah, I don't have any extra documents. So yeah, because we don't expire, and we're tribes, we're Indian tribes, those of us who are not even connected to a tribal group, per se, because we are our own Indian tribe, all right? So like, share, subscribe, you guys. If you want to email us for a private consultation, you can do so at themullings at gmail.com. You could also email us and join our online tutor school class at themullings at gmail.com. And for all these things that you hear me read, about you can email us for writs, a copy of our books, affidavits, liens, etc., lawsuits at the mullings at gmail.com. Now, a lot of you guys have received a lot of our stuff already. We just send it to you randomly. <laughs> and um, now you can get a flash drive, get a hard drive, do what you need to do, and send it out to one or two. Each one teach one, each one help one, and we'll all be okay. We'll be well. <laughs> like, share, subscribe, you guys. Have yourself a great day. Thank you again for sharing this with me on Instagram. And for all of you guys sharing stuff with me on a daily basis, I will try to make it public as quickly as I possibly can.